It's Sunday today, as you know, and it's worth quoting from the Bible, isn't it? You know, uh, peace, peace, they said, and there is no peace. And that's like unity in the party. There's no unity. There's been a war on. And it's been not low over the last couple of months. It's been going on for the last five years since Jeremy Corbyn was elected democratically as the Labour leader. And the, and the right wing, and as Tosh said, the Parliamentary Labour Party have got away with murder. They stabbed them in the back. They stabbed them all over. They sabotaged them. They sabotaged the party. I mean, they, they, they prefer a Tory, gov a Tory government to a Corbyn-led Labour government. Let's be clear about it. And therefore, it's a, it's a scandal. It has been a betrayal of our membership. And it's about time the members had a say on this. It's about time we had a conference, in other words, democratically decided. it. I mean, it's great to have one now. We should have had one 12 months ago. I don't think Corbyn should have been resigned. I think he should have said, hang on a minute. I'm a Democrat. Let the rank and file decide. They can see what's happening over the last five years. Let them put forward a, a solution to this problem. And for, for unfortunately, it didn't happen. But then you had Starmer coming in, unity, 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 which is a lot of baloney, as we know. And he said, oh, and now he's come out in his, on his own colours, isn't it? Red, white and blue. And he's got rid of the, the left from the shadow cabinet, got rid of Corbyn, and now he wants to get rid of the whole membership. That's the way it's going. And all we're going to say, the members should decide. And that's why you have to have a recall conference. After all, shouldn't they decide who should be and who should not be a member of the Parliamentary Labour Party? Shouldn't they decide who should be the general secretary or who shouldn't be? Shouldn't they decide the principles of the party? Should it be the red, white and blue of Starmer? Or should it be the red flag of socialism and internationalism, which I've always stood by? And therefore, it's the membership who should decide. So we've got to do move mountains. Yes, that's what we've got to do in a campaign. Go down to every constituency, every local party, every affiliated organisation, push motions, demand the recall conference, force the NEC, NEC. In the Constitution, they can call a conference in 10 days. Get off their backside and call a conference and let the Labour, let the work, let the ordinary members, they are the party, let them decide on what's going on and not these crooks at the top, for God's sake, that's going on. So I think, yes, we've got to get our, our shoes on here, we've got to get our skates on. We shouldn't be pessimistic. We've got to get, we, there's, there's an anger out there in the party. Let's tap into it. As, John, as Tosh said, let's mobilise it in order to ensure that we get the democracy and get the Labour Party ranks back in order to account to these leaders and put in a proper leadership that's going to lead this pair party.